Um, hello. Greetings. Um, you clicked on this video. I don't, I don't know why you clicked on this video. Because uh, there are about a billion and a half of these videos online. Um, currently, I just searched it before I pressed record. And uh, there's a lot of videos like this. And if you read the title, you know what to expect. So, um, what's up, YouTube? Domino with a zero. And uh, welcome to a Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon news update. Uh, for real, though, we are going to talk about this just for just for just a quick minute. Um, you know, I debated if I wanted to talk about this because obviously the news came out on like what Friday. Uh, it's been what five days, something like it hasn't been that long. Anyway, news came out a few days ago, and I didn't talk about it. I didn't talk about it anywhere. I might have talked. I might have sent like one or two tweets on it, but. Um, it just wasn't that big of a deal. Uh, and then today we got some more news. So we're here to talk about the new Lycanroc form. It's the only Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon news that we've gotten since the game was announced. So we might as well go ahead and talk about it. And I think I might have some different opinions than at least some of the people that I follow and some of the videos that I've watched. So uh, hopefully I will remember to put it up right here. But uh, if you didn't know, if you've been living under a rock, um, there was a new um, Lycanroc form uh, officially announced um, on Pokenchi, which is a Japanese show. Um, they showed, it might have been Sunday night or something like that. It showed a clip, it showed a couple clips of this new Lycanroc form. And basically it's called Dusk Form, Lycanroc, Lycanroc Dusk Form. Um, we didn't really know too much about it, except the obvious that you can tell from its appearance and that it's... Uh, a hybrid between the midday form and the midnight form uh, and I think it does a pretty good job at it. Am I super excited for it? Yeah, maybe not um, but you know I, I don't hate it you know a lot of people were, are talking really bad about it and I don't think it's that bad I think it's a decent uh, let me pull up a picture so I can look at it but I think it's a decent representation of a mixture of the two obviously it has the main of midday form uh, with the spikes of the midnight form uh, or maybe it's the main of the midnight form with the overall body of the midday form and then I think the color at least in the anime I think the color does a pretty good job of being about the same about what it should be um, the in game that we saw it looked a lot brighter um, than the other but if they if you know maybe they can adjust that or at least in the anime uh, I think it has a pretty good a pretty good representation of what it should be. So I don't think it's too bad. Uh, and then today the news that we got was that its ability is going to be Tough Claws, which uh, like powers up moves that make direct contact, which is pretty cool. Uh, and it's going to be able to learn Midday Forms uh, Excel Rock as well as Midnight Forms Counter. It'll be able to use both of those. So uh, you know when we see the stats, maybe it'll be good. I'm not much of a competitive battler, at least not yet, but. Uh, there's that. There's the news. That's the news. Now, as far as why I'm I'm okay with this announcement, I don't really want to know too much about Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon before the game comes out personally. I know a lot of people do. Uh, but for me, we just played Sun and Moon. In fact, I, I don't even remember Sun and Moon. I've been thinking about playing through Sun and Moon on the channel, but uh, because I don't remember much. So if they don't tell us too much and then they drop the game... Well, they pretty much showed us with this announcement that there's going to be some new stuff. You know, at least there's some new forms. And it's not just going to be a complete replay of the game. There's a new Lycanroc that we know of. I wonder if there's going to be like a new Mimikyu. I could definitely see them doing something like that. Um, you know, uh, we know that there's going to be new forms for Solgaleo and Lunala with uh, Necromza, Necrozma. I always flip that name around. But, uh, but anyway, that excites me and I think that's pretty cool. Um, so I'm definitely looking forward to that. I'm super looking forward to Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon. Uh, but that's really all the news that I have. Again, I don't want to make this too long of a video. Somehow I've already almost rambled for five minutes, which is just crazy. It's like twice as long as most of the videos that I've seen. But uh, but anyway, we're going to go ahead and get out of here. Let me know what you think about um, Lycanroc uh, Dusk Form in the comments below. And we'll see you next time for hopefully a more exciting news update for Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. Until then... Have a blessed day.